Your client was sentenced in May of 2023 for disorderly conduct as assaulting your existing officer was dismissed. And he was sentenced to probation and 30 days on the alcohol tether. He was permitted to travel to Virginia for a funeral. Upon his return, there was a probation right. violation whereby he pled guilty on June 21st. The court sentenced Mr. Rudolph to five days jail, suspended that jail pending a jail review on August 28th. On August 21st, we held the jail review and adjourned it to October 23rd, whereby we were at the court to schools program. So we thought it appropriate to set it for today's date instead of the court to schools program. And so today is the date scheduled for the jail review. And Mr. Schenke? Your Honor, I've had an opportunity to review the jail review. I saw the recommendations. I'd ask they be adopted. Nothing further from the defense. And so, Mr. Rudolph, did you go to um, Ms. Shaw had instructed you to do? Your Honor, it was an oversight. Um, I always, the first thing I do every morning when I wake up is check whether I have to report or not. Because I have to plan, because I don't drive for obvious, excuse me, obvious reasons. Um, it was an oversight. I, I understand tested, that. And that was the I one. Tested, that was, I, yeah, excuse me. Excuse me, please. Just one moment. Was it negative or positive? That's a that's a problem. What's a problem, sir? W what are the test results? Your Honor, I respectfully want to address the court. I left my house at the age of 17 to join the military, to join the military police corps, because I love law, I love order. But what is going on in this country? is a gross misconduct of justice. I respectfully ask you to release me from probation. I'll pay my fines, and I'm done with this circus. I, and it's not on you. It's not on the court. It's, it's, if my last name was Biden, I wouldn't be drunk in front of this court. Everyone knows it. If my last name is Trump, I'd be on a cross, crucified. And that's the only person that cares about this country because the Democrats and half the Republicans want to roll this country under the ground. And I've seen too many brothers and sisters die for this. And that's, and that's all I have to say. Whatever you want to do to me, I don't care. I, I can... What? What's the balance of my... I'm not asking you to do it, but I've done it plus 10. Well, I appreciate your um, restraint in choosing your words carefully. And to answer yes, your question, sir, your test, your test was negative. And Thank you. The, and um, the court... Please let me go. That's all I want. I, I won't step foot in line down anymore. I'll pay you the couple hundred bucks I owe you. Please leave me alone. That's all I ask. That's why I live in Monroe. Because I don't want to see anyone. I don't want to deal with anyone. Sentenced you to 18 months probation. You're eligible for early discharge. So you have a few more months to go if there aren't any violations um, for the next few uh, months well, they, for, you to, for you to request early discharge. Ma'am, with all due respect, yes. that's not that's not acceptable. Okay. I've earned the right well, to do what I want to do. And 
so what's the balance? So if I don't comply, what's going to happen? Oh, this is the part where my lawyer should speak up. My court appointed lawyer, even though I paid $5,000 for a long time to represent me, and then he drops me because he's a shill. Yeah, raise your eyebrows. What Nothing you on behalf of that time, Mr. Rudolph has, yeah, right. uh, has made his statements, and I still respectfully request that um, jail not be imposed. Thank you, Judge. Thank you. Mr. Rudolph, um, <clears throat> you absolutely have the right to um, behave as you want to within the confines of the law and within the confines of this court's order regarding probation based upon the events that occurred on March 18th, <clears throat> which is why you're in front of this court. Oh, because, because, because sir, the, the sir, I don't mean to, excuse I don't, me. I don't, Mr. Rudolph, uh, Mr. Uh, Rudolph, uh, please. Uh, I allowed you to say your piece, so please that's been. refrain from interrupting the court while I am speaking. With the exception of your use of alcohol on your trip that this court gave you permission to attend for a funeral for one of your um, comrades, if I recall correctly. Other than yeah. that, there has you haven't had any other violations. So the recommendation is for the jail review to be adjourned to not impose the jail at this time. So that's what the court's going to do. I will also, sir, remind you that when you are, when you have your appointment with your probation officer, that that is also an extension of the court. I'm I do not, I don't mean that. I, just, just one moment, please. Please let me finish. I'm raising my hand like I'm in grade school. Go ahead, ma'am. The communication that you have had with Ms. Shaw is less than stellar, and that cannot continue. The staff here does not do not need to be subjected to the language and types of communication that Michelle was subjected to. Yes, Mr. Hand. Rudolph. Mr. Rudolph, yes, did, did you, yes, did you yes, understand what I did Yes, ma'am, I do. Ad nauseum. Ad nauseum. That's Latin. I don't understand that. I'm very well educated. As well I didn't as say the, you weren't, sir. All right. All right. First Amendment. What? I can't speak what I have to speak? Well, let me also state this, sir. While there is a First Amendment right, right, this, I didn't this pull court, a fire alarm. Excuse I didn't pull a fire me. alarm on a, on the me, sir, floor. Please let me stop vote. interrupting. I'm stop sorry, but I know. I deal. I deal the time to Mrs. DeSanto. Please. Excuse me. I yield. My staff does not need to be subjected to that type of behavior. If you want to speak, could... excuse me, yes, stop interrupting, please. I'm just letting you know that behavior and communication will not be tolerated. So please refrain from doing so, so that there may not be any other issues moving forward. I, can I can I get on the record, ma'am? I'm stubborn. Can I get on the record? I'm sorry. Sir? I didn't think we were... Ma'am, ma'am. Just, excuse me, sir. Just, sir, I sir. Can, I don't give a crap. I got all day. Mr. Rudolph. Mr. Rudolph. Ma'am. I ma was not done speaking. I was not done speaking. Please oh, refrain from interrupting. Thank you. Thank you. 
No. Your Honor, I want Mr. Shefke's job because he doesn't have to say anything. I say something on your behalf, Mr. Rudolph. I was trying to make it so that you wouldn't go into custody. You seem like you wanted to have something to I'm say. I advised afraid. you of your right I'm to remain silent. I'm not afraid of that. Okay. I advised you of your rights. I'll pay the fine and leave me alone. I respect the court. That's the only Are reason you... I went into the Mr. military. Mr. Rudolph, please. Mr. Rudolph. Mr. Rudolph, yes, you, your behavior would suggest that perhaps you don't respect the court. I yes, have a question. What is your what question, is your sir? Final question. Can Mrs. Shaw figure out how to correctly document a notice to appear? Because you know what? I like her. She's nice. She She's cut me breaks. But apparently, she don't know what boxes to check. I have one eye, and I know what failure to appear and then Zoom be two different things. For the record, that is it. Thank you. Sir, God bless you. Sir, some individuals may make mistakes. Yes, ma'am. So maybe perhaps. No, no. No, no. Me. no. You know what, ma'am? No, I, no, I, I re respectfully. No. You know what happens? No, let, excuse me. Let me finish without interrupting the record. Let me finish. She sent you a notice to appear for your oversight meeting in December, and she mistakenly indicated it was in person. She, there's no, listen, you're going to be emailing back into her today so she can correct that. You aren't given, a, you weren't given a fail to appear. So, okay, I see that your lips are moving. You are muted so that you're not interrupting the court. You don't want to listen to what this court has to say, so we are done.